good little stroll here on Michigan Avenue. Yeah, see, this is downtime. Downside about doing stuff in the winter. So when you come down Main Boulevard like this, there's nothing to really see. So. Over here on the south loop, it's kind of dead. And I'm hoping you guys have questions that you want answered about motorcycling, about getting ready for the season. You know, feel free to email me at shytownrider1911 at gmail.com. Because we are coming into the season, and um, you know, people are going to want to start learning how to ride or getting back on the bike again. You know, I always love this kind of stuff at this time of the year because, you know, if he sees me, this guy's running up on me. <laughs> like he wants to race me from stoplight to stoplight. Some people really get into that. So, especially when they see a motorcycle, you know, again, don't find yourself being pulled out of your skill set. If you don't feel comfortable with moving off on somebody or, it just isn't a good thing to do. Just don't do it. Um, an example of some guy like this, um, I'm just idiotic. So, not this time of the year. Particularly not this time of the year. Your tires aren't warm. You're just going out for a quick ride to just kind of, you know, keep your keep your uh, skills skills up. So he's about to run right into his car. Just to run to another light. We're not getting away from each other. This makes no sense. But he sees a bike and he's like a, a little puppy and he just wants to go get it. Oh, take the bike. Run, run, run. Now, you know, you gotta watch out for this guy, and that guy. And, like, two, two dimes will get to 20. This is him right here. Oh, whoa, I'm wrong, that's not him. Hit my shoulder and lose my camera angle. Jerk. Sometimes you really have to be very mindful, have be very mindful, particularly when you come on traffic. Because sometimes these people are just really, especially downtown, just really looking to just get on by, especially cabbies. So I have a strategy for that. You know, this person's about to, the guy in the Volvo was about to run me over. And again, here comes the cop. Just move out of the way, no big deal. You should be aware of enough of your environment to know where your exit routes are, or escape routes are, in a case like that. 
and who's all around you. Don't wait until you come into the situation. Be ready for the situation. And once when you have that mindset, it's no big deal. You know, on a nice day, this is not something, you know, it's not a big deal. But you also couple it with the fact that you may be cold, a little windy here in Chicago. People have had a long day at work and they're commuting. Or they're just general jerks. Got to have a plan. Adjust my camera because I keep on hitting it with my helmet, with my shoulder, in the current position it's in. This is the funny thing. Why is he slowing down? But okay, he's slowing down. He's an idiot. Okay, it is what it is. For those that don't know, we are on the, what's known as the Gold Coast, um, North Lake Michigan, uh, North Michigan Avenue. <laughs>